So this is an example of how to prepare a mosbal holder. What you must have uh, is uh, a couple of uh, spatulas. Uh, a pair of tweezers also will be helpful. Uh, of course, the mosbal holder, which is composed of the main uh, holder and its cap, uh, a glue, simple glue. Um, and of course your powder. You might also need a, a, a blade or a paper cutter and um, you must also for uh, um, the packing of the powder you should also need a disc made of styrofoam and uh, you must uh, you could prepare yourself this kind of disc by using a, a disc cutter or a washer uh, maker like this one but anyway I will send you many many of these uh, discs uh, much uh, more than uh, the, the, the holders so you will have plenty to prepare your samples this is, uh, this is because the powder must be well packed inside the holder so um, you must first weight your powder uh, you must calculate that uh, the iron uh, that uh, must be in the holder should be around uh, should be around uh, 10 uh, milligrams of uh, total iron, um, uh, which is contained in the sample uh, per um, uh, square centimeter. So uh, this is about uh, uh, more or less about a square centimeter. This uh, most bar holder, maybe a little bit more, but anyway, uh, about. 10 to 15 milligrams of total iron in this holder will uh, uh, give us uh, a good um, um, rate uh, for the um, acquisition. Now, uh, after waiting your powder, you should insert it in the holder. Let's say that I have weighted this powder. Uh, you must cover up all the area of the holder and the powder should be well spread on its surface okay I know this might be a little bit difficult inside the glove box uh, for me actually uh, if you have uh, uh, thick gloves that's gonna be a little bit difficult but uh, I think that uh, if you do it uh, sometimes then you will uh, find the best way to do it. You see what I'm doing is I'm just tapping uh, the holder for the powder to spread around and make a, a, a thin layer on the bottom of the holder. Now you should uh, take the styrofoam disc for this I need to push a little bit this disc should be should not be too thick because it should be packed together with the uh, powder inside the holder but anyway I, I will have them ready for you okay then maybe this is not as thick as it should be a little bit more Don't worry about this, I will have them prepared for you, you don't have to do this procedure for the holder. Okay, you should apply it, you should cap the powder carefully and 
take edges of the stereophon disc and put them inside the holder. This is because the powder needs a kind of soft material made also from uh, uh, elements that have low uh, um, atomic uh, number so uh, the radiation shouldn't uh, be diminished when it passes through the holder then uh, you should apply the glue at the edges of the cup like this I know this is sometimes it's difficult because the glue sometimes it spreads around but you should take it the edge like this and then tap it press it okay, maybe you can use a, pair of, uh, uh, a piece of um, uh, paper that doesn't actually stick well to the glue after a while Okay. After the wi uh, while, the glue will dry up, and then you have a well sealed Mosbar holder. I know this is must be quite difficult if you do it inside the glove box, uh, because handling of uh, the all this uh, stuff with uh, thick gloves is it's more difficult than you do it actually in. Um, in air as I'm doing it here but you should find a way to uh, to prepare it gradually and then with a pen you should note the sample code this is actually a holder made of alpha iron oxide Okay, or the code that you make and uh, maybe you should also uh, write down the quantity of the sample contained in the sample folder so this is more or less the procedure if you would like to ask something of course we will be in touch